Hi, I'm Tinny from Mini Bowl Design, and today I'm going to address some of the questions I've seen on forums on the internet. They keep cropping up, so I thought I'd do this video and answer all of them just so people could go back to this video as a reference in the future. Uh, the questions are about the Isofly stove and just general operation and how to get the fuel from the stove back into the bottle and whether it's messy or difficult. So, first thing you want to do is find the largest hole, there's four holes in the top, three for legs and one to fill. And you want to fill that. And you want to do it before you put the legs in because this water has to go down through a baffle system and without the legs in it gets a chance to flow and the air gets to escape a lot better. It holds three ounces of just cold water. Okay, now, once you've done that, you can either put your legs in or you can fill it. I'm going to fill it first. I'm going to put a little extra in here so I'll have plenty to dump back out again to uh, show you how to empty the fuel out. Okay, next we're going to put the legs in. Now these legs are bent to fit the bottom of the hiney pot because it's smaller than the diameter of the stove. And these legs go down through the stove top and then go through another baffle that keeps them from going sideways. Okay, now I'm going to pull the wick up a little bit for medium cooking. Put my hiney pot on and then simply light the stove. Now I'll turn the lights out so you can see what the flame looks like. Okay, once you've finished cooking your meal, simply take your pot off, blow out your stove, and be careful, these legs can be a little warm. Pull the legs out. Now, you'll see the biggest hole right here. That's the one that you want to use to dump your water out. So, tilt it up and dump out your water. When you get ready to dump your fuel back in, take the top right off your fuel bottle and you'll see that the Isofly stove has two holes right here on the rim. Now take your fuel bottle, put it over the edge, and then you can see that you can simply dump your fuel right back into the bottle. There. I'll put the top back on your bottle. Basically, you're done. I'm Tinny from Mini Bowl Design. Have a great day and get out and hike. Bye bye. <laughs>